Hello, and welcome to Four Emperors, a Thief Gold Band mission by Grand Warden. Let's just jump straight into the screen so I can hear myself and uh, read the briefing. To rule over the people is to guide them. To be a source of wonder and inspiration for an emperor is the pinnacle of mankind, and all should seek to match him in greatness. But no matter how brave, strong, smart, or fast, even an emperor can only take so many breaths. And yet, if we use our lives to better theirs, our legacy will live on for all generations. Final speech of one Kua, Emperor of Karatin. The other night, you met up with an associate at the Loon Lagoon for some drinks and a good time. As the hours ticked by and the mugs were emptied repeatedly, the topic of conversation eventually changed to be about a cave located on the outskirts of the city that stretched deep underground. Your friend went into an expedition into the cave a few months back, discovered a new passage likely opened up by the big earthquake last year. Venturing into parts unknown, the expedition returned with news that they had found the entrance of an ancient tomb, easily older than the entire city. He went on to say that since the discovery, everybody who descended into the cave with the intent of exploring the crypt was never seen again, except for one archaeologist who claimed that he was attacked by living flame and barely escaped with his life. Naturally, the idea of almost certain doom wasn't enough to dissuade your desire to delve into what sounded like a precursor to. Therefore, after making contact with the archaeologist and obtaining his notes, you made your way into the cave. After about an hour of tight passages and windy tunnels, you found a rope dangling over a narrow pit. Based on what the archaeologist told you, the entrance to the tomb should be just ahead. Word has spread of an ancient crypt discovered deep underground, leading back to the Lost City. You're here to plunder it of its riches. Aim for at least a thousand loot. Well, uh, that was hard. An archaeologist who told you where to find the tomb is certain that it holds the remains of ancient precursor emperors and that they buried a particularly valuable treasure somewhere inside. See if you can find it. Don't let this crypt become your final resting place. Once your pockets are full, leave the same way you come in, came in. Normal hard experts. Uh, I think I'm just going to go with hard. I don't have any particular reason to believe there's differences, although I didn't check. Uh, I, there's no objective differences here. Um, given my usual propensity for taking full damage, I'm going to stick with that. This certainly looks like a uh, part of the Lost City, doesn't it? I thought it was also there, but it's just a texture. In fact, this, this is exactly like... Well, this bit of the structure... It's exactly like... Uh, the bit where the... Cream in used to be that were replaced with mages. Little big earthquakes happening. I wonder... <gasps> can reach up there. Maybe not. But also... I wonder if there is anything up there. There might not be. Apart from a... tip of a brazier. There's a pile of ash, but there doesn't appear to be anything else. Speaking of which, what do I have? 15 broadheads, 10 water arrows, 2 fire arrows, and 2 rope arrows. Oh! A papyrus to read. Oh, some healing potions, that's very nice. I will probably need them. Garrett, if you're crazy enough to try and explore that crypt, I won't stop you. At the least, tell me. let me tell you about what happened to me down there. The first room had large statues that seemed to depict a quartet of precursor emperors, though their names didn't match any emperors I know of. There was an inscription stating the tombs contained their most valuable treasure, but it hinted that you'd have to be as great as the emperors to claim it, but not necessarily keep it. Beyond that room was a series of poles connecting some tombs, but none of the coffins belonged to any of the emperors. Perhaps they were knights who served the emperors in life. Soon after, I reached a huge chamber with multiple platforms above an abyss, but I saw no bridges to let me cross. Tattered scrolls suggested that only one of the emperors was brave enough to cross, though I can't imagine how. Just as I turned to leave in search for clues, I was ambushed by what looked to be a ball of living flame spewing tongues of fire and giving chase like a predator. 
Somehow I managed to get away, but not without plenty of severe burns. I took everything I had to crawl back out of this cave, my body screaming in pain, just so I wouldn't die down there. I was pretty lucky, because from what I've been told, nobody else who entered that crypt has come back. If you end up becoming the next boss, Oddie's curiosity gets me killed. Don't say I didn't warn you. Well, you did warn me. I won't say that you didn't. Ball of living flames. Maybe it's just fire elementals to worry about. You know, we have lots of water arrows. We are the four emperors of chaos, the greatest of all rulers of Karathin. But even the greatest must one day fall. Now we rest amongst our precious treasures. You must be brave, strong, smart, and fast if you desire to earn our great wealth. You must possess none of these qualities if you desire to return home again. That's ominous. Emperor One Core, the Valiant. Emperor of Flame. Emperor One Ghana, the Swift. Emperor of Wind. Emperor One Chaos, the Mighty of Earth. Emperor One Caro, the Wise of Water. Lights. I forgot the. I mean, I guess it's not a problem if there's, if there's nothing to. Hello? I think I hear a fire elemental. I think I saw it. Well, as long as we don't run into it, there's no problem. Okay. That's right, I can deal with fire elementals. Some poor Taffa who came here before us. Oh, well, the guy's map notes didn't include a map of any kind. See? Fire elementals. Oh, that sounds like another one. Oh, it's up there. Wait a second. There wasn't one up there before. That just spawn a new one. He needs to be brave and smart and whatever to get loot. I just need to throw it and pick it up. This way, but I guess I'm not going this way. Else I've not been this way. Hall of the Heart. Oh, it's bravest me pass. Words of the Valiant. The fearful man flees from the light, afraid of what it will reveal. But one core of the Valiant always seeks the light, his courage guiding his path.
Well then, courage. Always seek the light, huh? Regardless of our distance. So hard. We'll get these four Emperor's treasures easily. Hmm. Hello, Barracks. Let's turn away, okay. So we go for the chests, and we got. Sarcophagus. Which is just full of dust. I'm gonna go this way because I see a. No, not because I hear a thing. Approaching. Or maybe not approaching. one walking about. Go and just all these light fixtures. Really just not lighting up the room very well, are they? Oh, there's one we saw patrolling around. Okay. friend. Why is he going around in circles? See if he's stuck. Yeah, he was. Mm, oh, maybe not. Yeah, he was stuck. Okay. Ooh, your breath stinks, Mr. Burke. Wait, that's where I started out that way. So, was the dark tunnel? There's also the way down here. <coughs> Ouch. Didn't quite mean to run right at the edge, but little lips like that are all oh, quite hello. More of the knight's tombs, I suppose. So 
in this center room. Ah, more bike tunnels. Going down. Well, I'll come back to those. I'll finish coming back. I'm getting the feeling I should go explore these bike tunnels now because I feel like progressing further is leading me towards the next part of the tomb. So let's go. Let's see where this takes us. Where are you going? Not down here, I hope. Hello? That's part of the air tomb that I have not been to. That's interesting. Turn around to look at me. Yeah, it's coming back. I guess it was just chilling for a bit. Now, oh, I guess this guy. Uh, Fell to the barracks. I was going to say that. Whoops. I am very bad at this aiming. Garrett. was a silly mistake. I thought that was a uh, destroyable mushroom, but apparently not. Apparently it's invisible to arrows. Well, it was being access to more of the tomb. 
Well, this does look like that part of the tomb that I haven't been to before. Well, I have been to it before. This is like, yeah, this is the same part in the other side of there. Hello, repair. Wow. Yeah, the roof fell on his head. That's unlucky. Like, yeah, getting eaten by Borix is a risk you expect, but when the roof fall on your head, that's that's harsh. Sorry, mate. I can see up there so well. Well, let's just leave them and hope to evade them. Oh, is this just, just the upper area? It's the same piece. Yeah, okay. Alright, well, where's down? That was the way in, right? I'm all turned it out. Well, this goes down. Barrack tunnels, the lower barrack tunnel gives me access one through here. It does give me access to more bits of tomb. I want to go where that barrack is first. I don't want him to come back. the strongest may pass. The weak man cannot move unless he calls for help and is answered. But one Kios the mighty uses his great power alone to forge the way ahead. He picks up boulders and makes stepping stones with pressure plates. His mighty power alone, huh? Ah. But this whole calling for help problem. How heavy is the papyrus? Not heavy enough. How heavy is the flash bomb? But boom. Alright, well your great strength alone can work like this, you know. Although I can't get back that way. You know what? I should actually go up and grab that rubble there. Ooh. 
Two rubbles. I do kind of like that there's a solution that doesn't require the stepping stones. Aha. There's this one there. I don't know. Interesting. Weird that there's a redundant switch. I've seen two empty sarcophaguses now. This is the water zone. More what looks like dark tunnels there. There you have Crayman. Life begins in spring, sprouting forth from the earth. Oh, he's not on the move, okay. Oh no, he saw me. Damn, how are you supposed to hide? I think we woke them all up. Oh, that's not great, is it? We did have to turn the moment I tried to get by. Love the way they sound. Guys, you're not very smart. You should look at the room where the lights are on. They'll tell you where I'm hiding. Well, you know, this is an excellent continuation of a thief tradition where doorways have pitch blackness. Now he's looking at me, so if I want to get past him, I need to be patient. Click, click, -a well, There's two doors out of here, and it's probably the far one that I need to get to, right? Fuck. Well, that's not good. one problem. Where did you come from? Doesn't matter. <laughs> Let's let that uh, put him to sleep.
Not that we really need to per se, but... Having uh, made a mistake and woken some of them up. Seems like a appropriate course of action. Although, I guess we can just run circles around them. Don't know how you saw me in the dark. Seems pretty dark. This is, this is excellent sneakery here. You still mad, you know what? Oh shit. My flash bomb. <laughs> Sorry. It's taking too long. And it made me waste a flash bomb. What's this note say? The fires of the summer sky warm all life, helping it to grow. Well, some of this life is not growing anymore. Cooled by an autumn wind, life is coaxed to rest. Oh, more tunnels, okay. Because the other Crayman tunnel I hadn't explored yet either. All of the eye, only the smartest may pass. Alright, okay, so let's collect these notes because I think these notes are a clue. Also, let's see where this takes us. At last, the freezing waters of winter wash life away to begin anew. Aha, uh -huh, it's another clue. Now I'm wondering. Bit of a tomb earlier. That I could have got to from Barrack Tunnels that I missed. Maybe that's just some loot I missed. Oh okay. This is a crayon tunnel. Very great. Anything in the water? It's my slate. You know what? There is. Can I get out again? I can. Alright, you know what? Back where we started is fine. Because one of the little things with notes, we've got two of the scrolls. back here, wasn't it? Or is this just the entrance? That was the entrance, okay. You know what? I'm actually going to go back and see where that... Uh... Ah! Um, that wasn't quite 
quite what I meant to do. That's not a healing potion. That is a healing potion. That's the one about the weak man. Where was this other passage I found? I didn't go down. Because I thought, well, it looks like a way into another part of the tomb. Oh, no, it wasn't. Here? Maybe it was here. You know what? Let's have the other healing potion too. That lava was hot. Oh, was it here? Maybe it was here. It's part of the wind tomb that I haven't been to, right? I've not been mentally keeping track of decorations here. Yeah, well, okay, this is definitely a area I haven't been to. Gas arrow, I don't know, my treasure. Right, so, this was the area I was thinking of. I can resume my forward progress now. Oh, you know, we can take some more boulders to the uh, puzzle if we really wanted. of the mighty strength puzzle. The ignorant man, when faced with the dilemma, can choose no answer. But one carries is a wise knows the solution even before the question is asked. Uh, not the papyrus. So, freezing waters of winter wash life away. To begin anew. So, freezing waters of winter washing life away? I mean, there's water. Pies on some sky warm more life. Life begins in spring, spreading forth from the earth. 
Built by an autumn wind, life is cooked to rest. So. To begin anew. Now, does that mean this is the start? Or is that the end? That's probably the end. So, spring, summer, spring first. Life begins in spring, spreading forth from the earth. So this looks like... It's weirdly stretched. Look diagonal. That looks like wind, water, earth, and fire. You know, I should see what happens if I get it wrong. That's what happens if I get it wrong. Let's just see if I could uh, tease it by uh, swimming in the waterfall. Okay. Summer is the sun. Autumn is the breeze. And winter is the water. Here. Another, it's a third. Well, if we need bricks, I can come back for them. Oof. I nearly wouldn't be able to make it through here. Well, I guess it isn't safe here. Places to hide. <laughs> of course, I am exploiting my knowledge of the AI here, and that these things look like they're floating, but they're actually just hovering. Even the fire engine elementals just hover. Thief doesn't support actual flying AIs properly. Which means they can't pass from down there to up here. Now, yeah, they, just, they just never had such an AI, so never wrote to support for it. Okay, now, because I was not really paying attention, I'm not sure where I was going. Oh, no, poor fellow. Okay, we've got a passage in there, a place in there. Can I, I don't think I can fit through it now. place in there I have not been to. there, okay, but it 
managed to explode on the other side of the wall, which is lucky for me. So this is where I was doing my jumping up and down. This was the first passage we saw them from. Hmm. Okay, so one, one question remains. Get in there. Uh, not the healing potion would be nice, but I don't think I don't think I can make this, right? Oh well, maybe. Feels like not properly possible, right? Feels wrong. Feels like it's can I see a hole in the wall or anything? I don't know that I can. Well, I haven't noticed any other possible ways to go from here, so maybe it's just inaccessible. It's just a mystery for another time. Besides, we've got all we need, right? Yeah. Let's keep showing these emperors how cool we are. All the wind, only the fastest may pass. The slow man cannot stop life from deciding his fate for him, but one gun of the swift has the speed to evade threats from wherever they strike. So we just run. So all we need to do is run. Actually, I think it's a skull stuck on the wall, impaled on the wall over there. Or a ribcage or something. You are to be commended for making it this far. But know this great one. All who consider themselves the bravest, strongest, smartest, and fastest must now share our tomb. Well, that's ominous, isn't it? back is closed, but this... I should have been a little more dramatic about uh, Oh no, what do we do now? ones that we came across before are now gone. So now what? Not that! Ah! Also not that. Hmm. Bricks help? I mean... I'm not sure if that counts as helping. Bricks at least let us... Uh... Where's the third brick? Bricks at least let me make this very unsolvable. Oh. Oh. That 
I did not expect. I thought I was... I mean, I guess the bricks had to be there for a reason, right? But I didn't think that was the solution. I guess I'm smarter than I thought it was. So now we have the... The rocks. What am I hearing? Oh. Let's take another look. Okay, so... We're gonna have to be quick, right? Alright, it's got the sound doesn't go long enough. So we don't have to be that quick. <sighs> unfortunately, that's the, the only unfortunate thing is that the sound's a little short. Hello. There's a loop over there. Good jump, Garrett, good jump. Now do it again. One more. This is the one with the lights, right? Go towards the light. The problem is... Now they're all dark. I light them. I cannot light them. What? What? I just walk, okay? It's like they designed this gym. Oh. For us to escape. The path to perfection lies not in making yourselves the best, but in pushing others to be better. Thus only the humblest man can succeed. You who have proven yourself fast yet slow, smart yet ignorant, strong yet weak, and brave yet fearful. Go now, bring forth our treasures. Carry on our legacy. Really? You're just giving me all the loot? Very well. Aha, uh -huh, here we are with the spilled ash. Back where we, where we started. And out we go. There was a lot of loot myth somewhere in there. Possibly some of the rooms I didn't manage to find my way into. Or possibly I was not looking in enough corners. But, uh, it was pretty cool. So that's the uh, late entry to the Summer Spirit build. Um, but being the other contest, it doesn't have a hard deadline. It was just like a soft target. Well, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.